Hey friends, this is four ways to start a conversation in five minutes or less. Yes, I'm serious. Okay, first up, keep it simple. This one sounds totally obvious, but pick a simple topic. Don't try and go in with all the things blazing and asking about something really complicated. When you are in a conversation or starting trying to start a conversation with someone who you don't know very well, start with something that you know. Start with something that you're passionate about, something you're excited about, and something that you can ask a simple, simple question about. So my suggestion is to start with questions that they can answer in yes or no or with one word answers. Now, most people will tell you that it's crazy town, but the thing to do is following up, which is way number two. So following up with those simple questions when you start asking about how they feel about something or how it impact, uh, impacted them or how they want people to remember whatever the thing is or what they would want to share with someone or what they learned, then people start thinking, oh, this is like... I want to keep talking to this person, right? So the next part of it is way number three is listening with intention. Now, this means that you are present in the moment. You are with the other person. You're making eye contact if you're able to and really being there for that conversation and that storytelling moment. It also means that you're listening and watching for things and pieces of the conversation that make them light up because then you can ask follow-up questions based on those things. And that lets the person know that you are really listening, which makes them feel seen, it makes them feel heard, and it probably will make them want to talk to you again, which depending on the situation is amazing. Okay, so the last thing, the last way, number four, is sharing your experience. One of the ways we can let people know that we care is by taking the time to share our story as well and to share our experience about the thing you're talking about. Switching topics is not a good idea, but this video is not about what not to do. This is what is to do. So to recap, we have keep it simple, follow up, listen with intention, and share your experience. So I want to hear what is a way that you have been able to start a conversation with someone else. And that's it for me. So I hope you have a beautiful, wonderful day. And until we talk again, happy writing.